cheated. Oh, very nice, very nice. Now one second. Technically still still do be changing checking the uh, the exit and everything. That's when you know when it's not really played yet that much. Because yeah, things are the antivirus is, is checking it all. And because it doesn't have enough info. Alright. There it is. Any sounds? Yeah, and the sound. Hell yeah. Let's go. Oh, there it is. It's gonna be nice. And demo was pretty good. Um. Demo was pretty good. Um. Let's try. Get it this way. I'm gonna up it for you now, too. I kill my ears a little less. A little less too. Some mega put up. See, yeah, tomorrow some more start trucking. Tomorrow gonna be a space marine too. And tomorrow gonna be major mythology because it's gonna be out tomorrow completely fully. So they're gonna be like a small sessions, a, a little bit of everything tomorrow. And then I'm gonna push for more a space party in progress after that. Because who knows, maybe I'll get an opportunity to get the the second one. Could be, could be. Get up slowly. Oh, dear, he is. Um, thank you, Quack. Thank you, man. Thank you, sir. Thank you. And, uh, yeah, yeah, yeah. Thank you, man. Thank you. Thank you. I appreciate it a lot. Plus 25, I'm insane. Thank you guys, thank you. There's a hardcore one there. How long can you last with the harshest settings? I'm insane. I'm go for the recommended because the like, demo was already quite something. Balanced mix of holding and maintenance. I guess mechanic is like with a lot of uh, increased maintenance, I see. I assume that's where they kind of like more going towards all those like issues that happen with the truck that you need to go and fix. 
kind of interesting like in terms of difficulty. It's like the actual, you know, pulling of stuff and like, you know, driving, piloting, I guess, is um, on the higher difficulties, it's kind of like a lesser part of the process compared to actually fixing things. You know? That's an interesting one. Get out of your comfortable seat. I already did that today. Get off. My comfortable fit ball. I'm mega comfy. Do the fixing. Just start to doing some fixes. Um. Repairing truck the first time. There's gonna be a lot of that. No. Charger. And the gaming chair. Oh, let's go. All patched up. Good. Now, before you get back on the road, it might be wise to check your CB radio. And the fellow trucker is there, right? See this symbol, pick up the mic. Uh, right mouse button, view list of responses. Press one, two, and three, select reply. The mic back once you are done to gain a control of your truck. Space to accelerate using the main thrusters. Um, and break and reverse uh, shift. And WASD fire maneuvering thrusters. Um. Q and E to roll. Um. Switch to external view by pressing C. Um. That's gonna be a feast. Um, blended with Hotasium. 
I'm gonna get some of them mega controllers, do them. And the odd banner, you're out of here. Time to contact the devs. Hold on, you can advertise your shit. Speed limit 85, doing it right. Yeah, it teleports you there at this time. Come on. Our gates allow you to move between locations within the galaxy. Um, uh, your track correctly right aligned, the gate will automatically power up. As all uh, gate uh, lights are green, uh, use the lever above your head to make a jump. Erase this hello. How are we doing? Here we go. trailer uh, within the drop zone um, better way to see like the roads and stuff As you read it, I say, the pain. We cargo designated drop zone, complete haulage contract. Drop zone will change color indicate traders within the safe area. Um, simple not as simple as it looks the main thing is the the, uh, the feeling of the size because I think I'm kind of too low there right now yeah, that's not too bad huh? Should be good now. Of the truck's magnetic lock system to you on the hitch from trailer as um can be done using mug lock a lever inside the cab. Eh? Make sure the entire trailer comes to a stop within the highlighted green zone or you won't get paid. Eh? One case. We go early delivery two dollars. Damn son, look at them go. Already four minutes. Already four minutes. Insane. Careful driving, not under zero XP. Right, come on, dude. I was careful. Time space tracker for the easy money, um Cargo Pal in Atlas Prime. That's level two. Are we? Great job. Famous should already be with you. But if you feel like spending some of that hard earned cash, just head on over to Palmview Station. You'll find they've got supplies, a few jobs on the board, and the best home cooked soya protein this side of Alpha Centauri. Alright, learn the basics. Enable dashboard controls and core truck systems. Um, for information, please take the time to read the user manual located in your glove compartment. 
Maybe truck in. That's simple. Set the contract and stuff. One sec. Kind of like the. Um, I don't think it's said um, about any of the copyrighted stuff. Get it through this one. Uh, seems kind of like on that kind of radio. This one. Oh, shit, you are cool. Thank you, sir. Thank you. Thank you. How are we doing? Thank you, man. Thank you. This route, there should be no asteroids and stuff, I see, at least. The Dokin. Let's go. Hey, Blakey. Thank you, sir. Thank you. Thank you. The dickhead brake shaking. Yeah. It was good, Guac. It was good. Um, the little bit of iron railing and all. Feels good. Um. Dokin camp to your line. Um. When you were close enough, the maglock system will become available. In position for pull the maglock uh, lever to lock the new target. Something yummy for the birthday? Yep, eating some some put out croquettes and some local mineral water. Closey one. Talking the most difficult. Actually, in the demo, it was kind of like way, way easier, I feel. So, you do have some Barjobi there. 
I'm actually kind of like, I think the align controls even for for the rear view actually is way easier to to control them that way. Like you look look at the camera and that's exactly the how would you expect it to be? Brother, relax with that shit. <laughs> no, Paco. There we go, man. <clears throat> Fucking sticky keys again, dude. Alright, this time I'm murdering you. This time I'm murdering you. It's already orphan everywhere. Everywhere. I use tiki keys off. Ah, oh, I see. All right, get that. I removed it now. Yeah, like also like took took um, the controls away also. Dude. No. Oh, like last time that was that was like. I don't. Uh, last time was like the, the the random master way there, wasn't it? And last time there was that uh, that the dink asteroid um, that I caught. And it instantly just like puts you in like you know, in some mega depth basically. They turned off, by the way, but you can check. And there is a setting apparently that if you click shift five times. It's still gonna enable. And considering you use the shift for the reverse thrusters here. And when you want to do things carefully. Then I'll lose the sound though. Oh yeah, of course. And now I get the sound back. No, I'm washing shift, nothing happens. Feels good, man. Get out. I'm gonna speed run now. Oh yeah, some beer is gonna be later then. Maybe this week. I kinda wanna actually just stream that too. Maybe I will. Like it's not gonna be like a long walk. I wanted to go to um, the brewery here, the beer manufacturer even, I would say. And grab some later this week. Maybe Thursday or something. Skynil, hello. A lot of content to be played there is it the short game. So basically, basically it's gonna be somewhat kind of like the Euro Truck sim in a way. So it's kind of like it, it depends what you what you want from this one. Like there's not gonna be probably there maybe will be some story. There maybe will be some story. Actually, you know what? One second. I'll give. I'll try to give the better the better rundown here a little. One moment. Uh, one second, uh, because I do have the what they what they uh, sent us. So one moment, one moment. I'll just gonna open it, and I'll give you a bit of a rundown of what we're gonna be exactly actually dealing with in this game. All right, so um, uh, what we're gonna be uh, dealing with this one? Who release no early access? So a wide range of haulage jobs, uh, trailer types, suppliers, and cargo. 
Navigate Dynamic Galaxy populated fellow tracker Stellar Events and Hazards, customize your rig with an extensive collection of parts and paint jobs, spacewalk to perform essential maintenance and collect salvage, trade small goods and contraband based on ever-shifting galactic economy, Easy radio mic to interact with the fully voiced cast of characters for an authentic tracking experience. So yeah, that's pretty much how it's gonna be. So it's not gonna be some sort of like crazy, you know, like story long playthrough, but there's gonna be like a lot of um a lot of those little things going on that you're gonna be encountering in the game. So depending on the amount of those events and stuff, and considering it's a full release actually here, right? Like it's not gonna be um like, it's not nerdy axes or something, so everything should be already in the game. So I think that should be quite good. It is gonna be not not a very long one, but it, it's kind of, it's one of the games where you kind of just, you know, in, in, invent yourself some things to do. You just kind of like pick something, pick something you want to do, something we want to achieve and get some like truck or something. For example, save some amount of money and get some, some specific upgrades and everything. Open the upgrade menu. Um, we'll get oh, there. Let's say I get that. So yeah, I would say I would say the uh, the amount of content should be good, but it's very specific content. Like it's not gonna be like some sort of um, like not a lot of hand holding and stuff. Basically, you're just gonna the the goal the goal is pretty much just like drive, uh, pilot around, uh, farm somebody, or uh, get some upgrades, uh, uh, get the better truck. But they also have like events, characters that you interact in the radio and stuff. So. It will have some sort of like semblance of like story and everything, I guess, in progression. So depending on how you want to play it, really, it's going to be either like short, I assume, when you get like, you know, if you, if you get bored easily out of all those like missions, like trucking around and stuff. Or if you're into this stuff, like some people playing, you know, like Euro Truck and everything for, well, to be honest, like for, for years in the more. And then this game should be pretty solid there. Can I assume if it's also gonna do well, you know, uh, with the uh, in terms of sales and everything? I would guess we're gonna maybe get some like extra content to and everything too. I wouldn't be surprised. Eh? And need to work on games area. too, yeah. I'll make sure your payment gets processed ASAP. Something about this one was like, I don't know, well, in the demo, right? And it's still what got me into it. Like something... Something about the game is uh, like really cozy and stuff. Except it can get like very stressful. That, but I guess that's that's when you get like the, um, the difficulties and stuff. If you don't want it to be too much. Because I remember in the demo it was quite brutal that way. Like you can get easily destroyed by some bad cargo holes. Time limit for phrase? Yeah. I, I'm not sure if there is like a limit. There is like a bonus you can get if you if you do it in a good time and stuff. And then there is a bonus for you. But I assume there are going to be some deliveries that are going to be like you know, in, with the limit. Even not just the bonuses but legit just the limit. $3 bonus. Boog. $1 better. Improving this attempt. Thank you, Nautilus. Thank you, sir. Thank you, man. Thank you. Thank you. 
Hey, Lewin, thank you. How we do, man? Uh, what are you doing? Um, all right, one sec. Close all this stuff. Yeah, they're still throwing some food in. Sorry. So like semi, semi out. Almost done though. And yeah, speaking of multiplayer stuff, they are not planning yet any multiplayer and co-op. Thing is, it's like two people team are working on this one. Even though, like, the publisher is uh, quite, uh, quite a massive one there. But still, it's a, it's a small team. But I would assume if it go well, maybe they will consider. Yeah, apparently these two people made it. It is quite impressive. Huh? Games that rate you annoying, I see. I could see that. Time limits, ratings, all that stuff, yeah. But that's the thing, it depends like what difficulty and stuff you play. I mean, there are some difficulties when you can just, you know, just um, do it relaxed. This normal one, we'll see how it will go. Alright, food get done. It's still so hot though. Oh. Insane. All right, there we go. Hey, Perdido, hello. Thank you, man. Thank you, thank you. I no longer have the non PayPal. There is one. There is one in description. Like, if you click on the banner, that's going to be the stream elements. If you go in the description, there is the old link that uh, that I used them before. You still can use that one. If you don't like the PayPal, you can use that one. I'm gonna keep it up. Maybe later I will like switch it to some other thing, but I yeah, I kinda wonder. The thing is Stream Elements has the special payment uh, system that allows you to receive like cars and a bunch of other stuff. But it's available in like 15 countries, which obviously Georgia is not one of them. So unfortunately, unfortunately that system is not available there. Not available here, rather. So yeah, the Extreme Elements only PayPal. And the old system is everything else. Well, PayPal too, actually. If it's like less than five bucks, it's actually better through that system. But it's also such a good mineral water, like holy. Oh yeah, sorry, I'm just like not really focused with this like heat man, it's insane. Ooh. It's crazy. <clears throat> yeah, that's why I really gonna be full force like some later. Later in September, I need to get it a little a little colder, man. It's insane. Twenty seven thirty. Well, I mean, now it's maybe already a little less, but it's it's the uh, humidity, dude. The humidity kills here. Not like it's 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 like I I understood it now because you know like back home like thirty like even like above thirty, like if you're not in the sun, you're gonna be kind of like more or less okay. Like outside, for example, in the shadow. It's all right, but here it's like, dude, like we have, we thankfully don't have sun in our apartment like whatsoever, except for early in the morning. And nowadays, I think actually not even because like sun rises 
from behind the mountains and now it rises like later and later and later so it's usually already like rising you know and kind of like missing us completely but it's just like the humidity is crazy like like back home like i was sitting it was kind of you feel it's hot but it's like well all right and here you're sitting you feel it's hot and then you also like you all like sweaty like you know like like now it's after the irl stream after walking right it's kind of understandable i guess a little the time sweaty and stuff but before the IRL stream, before I left, I changed like my t-shirt and my t-shirt I was just sitting and playing games in, right? Was like, like the back had already like marks basically from the wet marks and stuff. <clears throat> just from sitting and doing nothing. I mean, I also fat, of course, right? But like still, it's like even, even my friend who is like stick, he's like 50, like four kilos or something, I think. And almost like my height. And uh, like even even he like especially with uh, after some food like we go we go to cafe he actually has it even worse than me probably because I, because I'm already f I'm a fat and I'm more used to kind of like like I I use uh, or like I radiate less heat I guess to process the food <clears throat> and he like after eating something like he's a stick and he's already like okay dude, like let's, let's 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 go somewhere already like let's go home or something I'm gonna start sweating like crazy now. Feels when you like breathing in soup, I see. I kind of don't really like feel it. I mean, I guess I kind of in a way do. Kind of, kind of. But yeah, it's just like, it's it kind of like all, all this uh, liquid from the air, just like it can, you feel like it condenses on you and you just like constantly like, you know, like wet pretty much. Like you're constantly like sweaty pretty much. And there's everyone here, you know. <clears throat> like I'm kind of like back home, for example, it's like, you know, you when you, when you like, like sweaty and stuff like, like I, back in the day when i was like i lost a lot of weight right when i had like more weight i was like even like when we were going somewhere when it's hot and stuff i was sometimes even kind of like torturing myself but i was putting like some like you know like the um, the tank top oh shit there he is um, there he is thank you sir thank you man thank you thank you i appreciate it a lot there he is then the east one one and only. Is it like some some account you made there or something from the old name or something? Thank you, man. Thank you, thank you. Appreciate it. Appreciate it. Thank you, guys. Are you killing it? Feels good. Eh? Feels good. Eh? So it's just kind of like I was putting like the tank top under like the regular shirt, right? So just like you sweat, but like so it's not noticeable basically. Because it kind of like, I don't know, feels, feels, feels weird, right? To walk around with like some marks on your clothes, right? From the, from the sweat and stuff. <clears throat> and here that's normal. I'm just going to see like some like, you know, like nice looking lady and stuff going. And you just like, like with some like, you know, like ice coffee or something. And you're passing and you see like her, her, her back is like completely like, you know, wet and everything. And like people kind of used to it here and whatever. It's just humidity and stuff. Everyone walking around kind of semi, semi wet, you know. I guess that's just kind of how it is. Huh? I mean, like the tropical climate here. It's like the humidity is like close to 100% quite often. It's like 80% is like normal here. So it's a good day, you know, when it's 80. The humidity is like pretty much close to um, 200. The air conditioning, well, they do, but like when you're outside, you know, walking, you don't really have air conditioning there. Like in the stores, like in the mall today, for example, they blast air conditioning like so hard that sometimes you're kind of scared that you're just going to catch a cold or something there because you go from outside like completely all like sweating and like hot and then you go in and it's just like, bro, it's like freezing here. And the the, the, like, the the best like how to feel this like humidity and stuff is just like you go to air conditioned store, right? Mall or something like really well air conditioned. You like hang out there for some time and then you just go outside. Like that moment when you just kind of like cross, especially if it's like, you know, the door is closed and stuff. When you, That moment when you like exit it and you, it, it, that, that, that's when you feel, you just kind of like can, can, can like, you know, perceive and sense it, you know, the, the humidity in the air. It's crazy. That contrast is quite something, dude. Already not hot there, I see. Yeah, here is just kind of like, yeah, 30, you know, problems today. Phones here. All right, sorry. Just like, hard to focus. Some food game and some, uh, with some heat gear. 
All right, back at it. Hopefully now, now we're not gonna have any it is sticky keys anymore, thankfully. So let's go on. Manual, we're actually gonna check then. See what's there. What is this guy doing here? Are we going? The theme is nice. Fun how he, he is behaving also in that in those in situations like that. Oh God, that one was a bit not happy there. Pause there. Slow down. Walking, bro. I'm in my line there. Maybe because I was too fast there. to get the better angle. Yeah, I think I need better angle probably. But maybe... I don't remember, was it giving some sort of input for that? Yeah, it seems already a little too close there. You think you so right there. Should be good enough. Gonna work with that. Should be good, huh? Not that good, huh? It's even closer. Yeah, 
the same than the one I need to go? I think it is, right? Oh, that I think was the one. Your battery. Brother, what is wrong here? Bit of an angle there. Oh, mother look ready. Oh, there we go. Why are you showing red then? Come on, it's the boss. I'm gonna be green when we connect, I guess. Didn't even show still. Alright, Joe boards them. A list of contracts available in the local area. So your certification skills list will expand, giving you access to new jump times and cargo to all them. Keep in mind that bonuses and deductions will differ between jump times and harsh penalties will be issued for abandoning holes or cancelling a job. Are you should abandoning holes, cancelling jobs. Alright, let's see. Well, let's see. Um, two jumps. A one jump, 790. Tinker. Standard recycle textiles. Diamond foil rules. Confectionery. 790. Sunday, February 9th, 3.47. Dude, what the fuck is this delivery speed? Eh? Look at them go. Expires in 4 hours, 46 minutes, man. It actually is in 2 hours, even. With 2 jumps, holy. The Edgeburg. Fine, we go this one. 10 contracts. Can I send this one to my bank? Get the invoice and everything. Confectionery from Bay in the Adrian. There. Behind Molden, Redux. Hmm, 150 here already. That's why you're Molden.
I feel like it's, you know, really drifting here. This shouldn't be a thing, really. Uh, shoot, Monkeys. Replace power cells at regular intervals. Prevent system failures, job delays, in the death. Uh, probably not a good idea. And they were exhausted for one more of your truck systems, eh? Now, uh, time for that maintenance guide, eh? Is it that better? Is it the ground one? It's gonna go a little bit lower there. Let's grab it anyway, yeah. Not too low though, because there's gonna be a lot of this trash there. Encountered the trash before. That wasn't fun. All right, let's see. They've got all the stuff there. Truck systems. That just gives you this stuff. Hmm. You're all fine. Okay, different systems there. Wasn't this like the main one or something? Actually, this one seems like... Uh, where's my spares there? That's the UCC. Check what that'd be also. Fuel. Got some other UCC still. Maglock power hatch. Core power. That's the charger power cell. You need some like spare charger ones, looks like. Climate control. Oxygen generator. That's also something we probably need. Air filters. Here, filters, cleaning supplies. Was there a way to charge it somewhere? There was something for that. Fuel. You just switch one of these then. Uh, Gravity compensator is offline. Eh? When the round you have been impacted and damage is likely occurred to poorly stowed items. Eh? Can be found under the lower stairs, requires both power and working UCC to stay active. Eh? Monk. I'm gonna take some damage there. Oh, wait, that's power cell there. Oh, those were. All right. So we did have some then.
151. The upgraded one. Well, I will need to re I will need to recharge it somewhere then. I will need to get to that. I don't think we had somewhere where we can charge. That's the charge for the suit. Actually, also do this there. Put the charge a, a bunch that way. Certifications. That we dealt with now. I guess we're just going to be charging them somewhere outside, I assume. I will work thrusters. Uh. I will heat if run at full throttle for too long. Uh. Red sun. So we need to go outside for that. Because uh, power output will be reduced until they cool to normal operating temperatures. Uh. Quicker recovery, manual venting can be performed by external thruster access panels. Um, and this sounds dink. The trucks here, there was one. Twenty-three. Uh, at least we didn't waste didn't waste much time. Okay, that's our cargo. Seems like. What if I can attach from both sides? Just feel like it's better too. Oh no, it shows there. So not that far. Mm, all right. I thought we were just collecting one of those. Huh? There goes the garbage on the route though here. Get outside of the road, huh? Now oh, there's not a pickup, I see. The job we already got. Oh, Happy shoot. birthday, Mr. Nerd. You've created this cozy little corner of the internet and kept it going through resolution and adaptability. Thank you for all you've done. I'm still here, thanks to you. Less than three. Thank you, AJ. Thank you, sir. I appreciate it a lot. Thank you, man. Thank you. Thank you. It's some nice awards. Thank you, man. Thank you. Thank you, sir. You guys are insane. Thank you. Thank you, thank you. We did do it in uh, through the donation alerts one, right? Seems like. Yes, yes. Like th those are through donation alerts. I will add them manually. I'm just not going to do it on stream. I'm going to add them so they're going to display on uh, what's the name? The bar. So they're going to display on the bar. They just from different systems, so they not automatically get there. But yeah, I will manually add them too. So they'll be there. Days going well, yeah. Days pretty good, eh? Days pretty good, thank you. So they will contribute to the bar too, absolutely. Kitchen to trailers, and um, I right, so it's the same kind of docking stuff gonna be there. Unlined, uh, correctly use maglock, okay, yeah.
on. Do you struggle with gravity sickness while driving? Try Gravitine before starting your journey. Gravitine will keep you focused, alert, you and star side up. Ask your doctor you if Gravitine is right for you. Side effects may include nausea, exhaustion, dizziness, headaches, heart palpitations, and space rash. Turn it up. You're listening. She believes the, the nation link worked. Page is void. Uh -huh. Not opening. Really? The secret about it, say, yeah, yeah, maybe some stuff like that they're going on. Some weird stuff. Let me see. Yeah, does it work for me actually? But it, it, it's not a big deal, really, as long as it's fine by you. That is okay. It still went through. That's all that matters. Thank you, man. Thank you. It actually is the same for me. Seems like it did like a little bit of. Oh no! Open now. It opened. Yeah, it was like first the loading spinning. And then boom, white screen, nothing happening, and then whoop, it loaded in the end. So yeah, not sure. Not sure. Yes, you guys about it, see. But that's fine though. Like as long as like yeah, if, if there are some issues, you can use the secondary link or yeah, just kinda wait, maybe it will fix itself. But yeah, it's all Gucci, yes, yeah, all Gucci, don't worry. Hopefully it will fix itself. Thank you for using the second one. Oh, benefits of having two. Like I always had only only PayPal, only stream elements there. Now we have an alternative for those situations. And see, some people already just prefer the payment methods there. Some people just, you know, have issues with the first one sometimes. It's nice to have the alternative going. A big piece of dried spice meat. That sounds nice, man. That sounds nice. Time to access Galactic Map anytime here. You can plan delivery routes and information about locations. So we need to get here. Medusa 6. I see. So we just go from here directly. Atlas Prime. That's the waypoints. Zoom. Aha, uh -huh, we can see what's in there. So we have some stores, a few. Trader. Security checkpoint. In one case. A way station somewhere. A black market, I see. Body shop, upgrade shop, there it is. So you need to go to the shop probably to see the upgrades. The toll booth. Red. Red energy. The energy drink Hyper highway. The toll booth. What are we going to be paying toll for? I wonder. Broadcasting non-stop across the galaxy. You're tuned to Gold Rock Radio. Well, I guess we'll find out. So we do the sixes and the opposite side. All right. Well, we got the the stuff pitched already, right? Can I 
Let's see the thrusters. All right, thrusters for now, good. Eh? Yeah, that's the one. Everybody are going there too. Shit, there's some junk there. Fuck all these maneuvers there, sir. That road seems like that they didn't clean it much. The fuck was that? Didn't clean the fucking road. Three already. Before that's already more than more than the delivery we're gonna do. At least we didn't get the whole the damage, so that's fine. Fuck was that? close to it. But what the fuck they hit there though? The roster is fine. Figure out the uh, charges. How to charge all the power cells and everything. A bit close to the middle there. So I need to get the certification as our mission there. It always it feels to me like from this view from the cabin is like feels like you're gonna get you get in uh, in the side thing there, but in fact you're kind of so far there. Like this is kind of close, but yeah, I guess there is like not that much inertia going on in space, but still, still kind of scary for reason. Cheating that much, basically. I can see some garbo there too, also flying. Like the fuck, dude. There's garbage there too. Clean the roads, eh? Unique looks like it, yeah. He was not there, I was not there. Well, the thing is, like as I said, Twitch increased the regional pricing also recently, so... Some people just kind of, you know... Are redoing uh, their finances and everything, and cutting some of the subs and everything with increased price and stuff. Stop your truck at suitable distance and the jump gate will power up. If you have any trouble, make sure you are facing towards the gate and use the stop signs to align yourself. Gates between zones and some sectors will stay inactive until you get clearance from the DIV. 
Ah, oh, shit. Well, I hope we don't have that here. I guess he gets the body. I see. I mean, what 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 is a uh, uh, nicer? What is easier for you? But I mean, I would appreciate absolutely. And the tier three upgrades are like the the best option for that. I feel because yeah, they just kind of like more optimal. And they are quite nice indeed. Eh? Okay, shall we? If that goes to business hub, that doesn't really go to the drop zone. And the problem is there is more risk to get some garbo here, but this one looks more clear, I feel. Okay, there is some garbo, I, I notice it. Yeah, that would be appreciated. That would be really appreciated. And tier trees are optimal because yeah, you get like better cut from tier three itself already, even without like unlocked, you know, better, better cuts. Tier three already gives you by default a better cut. Yeah, yeah, it's like six points for the price of five. So yeah, if someone is down for that, that would be very, very nice. I don't know if the upgrades actually affected by the current Sabaton stuff. The Sabaton, the uh, September. Uh, September is on. So they do have the discounts for the longer, the longer ones. Um, you saw good guess why, don't worry man. Out un understandable. I'm already happy that people consider supporting me in all those ways. It's insane. And absolutely a very appreciated. Charles driving this bad bad. Didn't damage the client property. It was my truck there. I relax. Thirty delivery though at least. Compensated for all this stuff. Speed was worth it. Alright, rank two. Skill points. So they wanted me to get some certification. Fragile loads them. Just in time jobs them. Jobs with tight deadlines them. 5% XP for just in time jobs. Attempts and cash for delivering just in time jobs them. Spacewalk efficiency. Perishable loads them. The long distance jobs increase delivery radius the long haul of them higher cab loads are granted at the away stations ah I see the loads are delicate and any damage to the cargo will result in substantial deductions upon job completion. However, fragile loads are great money maker for careful drivers with a nice bonus for cargo delivered in pristine condition. Each level of certification will give you access to increasingly delicate cargo jobs. Mold face. Cool. 
Clearance for jobs with multiple trailers. Plus two trailer link. Damn son. I'm gonna hey, get the long boys there. Nice job getting your fragile loans proven. Now that you're cleared to haul brake hold, I got a job I think you can handle. Swing by New Liberty Terminal over in Alice Prime if you're interested. Alice Prime, you say? All right. Well, maybe we'll find some jobs to deliver there. No, that's the job as you do. Okay, so this, that's kind of, I guess, the, the story you can get there. Prepare Barrow for one final job, then, son. So that's the story for you, then. All right. There is some stuff like that, then. Yeah, they figured where to charge these, um... House ownership was out of your league, I say. Should become the Star Tracker, true. That's <laughs> easy, alright. All got cancelled anyway. I assume it's... Wait, no. Yeah, but you still have the fuel also on top of all the batteries there. Let's try the business hub then. gonna refuel this debris proximity To like dodge all the debris that way. That's tricky there. Eh? Alright, there's job board there. It's an Alton's Prime. The thing is, I want to like see how they, how they even refuel. Let's go to the fuel and see. Kinda weird that it doesn't say really.
moment. Let me alone. This is not too bad, eh? but totally didn't offer me to to get the the uh, charges though. Huh? Sure, if I want to be, it. could go that way, but I guess. Still do be wondering how do we charge that stuff. I would assume there's some sort of like generator we have in. Minion doesn't really have that though. We're gonna try the store, I guess. Probably no cash and carry then. This one is trying. Starbreak supplies. I guess you need to uh, to buy the charged ones, but that's expensive. They're like a thousand, I think, or something. That's a shitload, eh? I could burn through them like after a few deliveries. Eh? in the store is them. Yeah, that's the, that's the body razor. Worth 25. Oof. Holy shit. So this one is discounted energy at least. That's good, I see. Pack of beer. Hell yeah, man. Alcohol. It's alcohol. A contraband somewhere. No, fridge, yeah. no, I'll call, it, I'll call it something else. And the shock sensitive stuff. How you replace the battery then if it's shock sensitive? I guess need to put them somewhere. Because yeah, those UCCs took a, took a hit with that with that stuff going down. Is this actually like the only way to recharge them? That doesn't sound right. I could sell those like with the uh, with increased price somewhere, I guess, to get a little more. But that's like three hundred bucks basically for for the charge. That doesn't sound right. Air filters, uh, electronic kits, meal packs. Oh, 
I work very hard on. Some decent value on these ones. What does that do? Craft supplies. Uh, so we're gonna be doing something with that. Group packs. Cleaning supplies. I mean, some of these seem you can like can just, can just like buy and sell. Outside of like the holes, you can also just like do some some loot deliveries on your own. Fifteen percent discount. Yeah, that sounds about right. Hmm. Shall we? Three thousand two hundred ninety-one. I have. I guess I can. But I, I feel like there should be a way to charge them, though. To the, to the trading stuff. Yeah, so if we like, disable it, it's just gonna fly anyway. Yeah, that's the carton stays. I don't know what they exactly do. I'm gonna continue, I guess, probably with quest. Maybe do will explain, but like we're gonna run out of uh, energy that way, so I'd rather fix that. Yeah, this one is not being choked here, so can we? Yeah, that was probably a better idea. It. CGSC. Yeah, we'll see how much of the board is going to be muted and everything, so. <laughs> I'm experimenting. I don't think they said anything about uh, being sensitive to that, but you never know. to put them on, on the bottom parts so and doesn't fall from the height. This one kind of like safe here more or less seems like. Didn't fly anywhere. Yeah, I do kind of wonder if there's a way. Before UCC is also going to be getting broken all the time. I need to buy those still. We sell bulk goods at low, low prices all over the galaxy. Swing by any of our many locations before your next haul. Cosmos Cash and Carry, Big Stock. Alrighty, guess the money already. Thank you for stopping by. I'm gonna be calling you soon. I still need to call mom also today. Oh, she already messaged me, but I wanted to call me later too. So, still gotta get that call going. Soon. Yeah, fine, let's buy some, I guess. Plus twenty can handle that. Alright, so they just like stay in the uh, airlock. So I guess when I on 
and disengage the Muglock, I will need to go and sort them out. Because I can't open it right now. Oh, wait a second, maybe I can. I can. Dude. Put down carefully when you're throwing it. Like crazy precision required, I guess. And jinx it. There we go. Nothing to lose by gathering info. Yeah, but why not? Why not? That's the Atlas Prime, actually. That's what I, where I need to go. That's also Atlas Prime. One hour and 42 minutes. I mean, that should be at least doable. But might be kind of closey one there. Wait, right here actually now. Uh, oh no, two jumps it shows. Am I mean, not in the Dusa Six myself? Yeah, I am. How does that work then? So this one is also me oh wow oh, from purity. Oh okay, so you pick a job, so you need to go there, pick it, and then return. Okay, I see. That's not that poor guy. Okay, so Atlas Prime, this one's six hours nine minutes, that should be like no problem, Moza. 
Yeah, they might actually maybe get like a good um, bonus because we're gonna do it fast. Hopefully. Hopefully. Cargo there. Some debris here. So go down. Them. And uh, where do we go? There. Alphans Prime. Oh, that highway there. Can call those highways, do they? Was it the exit of that one? No, I think it was the previous system when I was going here. I caught some... something, I'm not even sure what. Problem like th th this part. It's like so, so massive that it's easy sometimes to miss something at the bottom part. Like this thing, for example, if I would be a bit lower there, I would probably catch that. And I still can catch something. Okay, I'm kind of getting in a really bad angle here. There is a guy there. Okay, there is this, this shit, for example. Like, why is it here? That rock there. Clean. Clean your highways. Hundred fifty to hit some rocks. Like a good idea. Clean the trucks. True. There is some like scrapper jobs we'll get there. I assume there's also kind of like those those like little quests that actually gonna gonna give us like some more inputs and info on how things work. Because I'm pretty sure they should explain to you how to charge things. Like I doubt the buying new power cells is the way to do it. I mean it could be though, but you kind of burn through them pretty fast and they're expensive.
Tango kind of shit, I think. Maybe, ah. Uh. Probably not work. Not good enough. Seemed a little, a little off, but why not? I guess. No. Sure, sure. No contraband here. Feels good, man. Not in the deal, sir. Man, going here for that will be probably big monkeys. Hopefully, that's a lot of trash here. I can see the trash all there on the way too, but that that uh, that road goes completely the wrong way now. All right, sure. If you dive in. There will be some upgrades for that later to like detect, you know. There is a detector that shows uh, the debris nearby, but like some sonar or something maybe would be better. So you can see where the debris is. Uh. And you kind of do see it from far away, kind of. Some big stuff there. Relax with laid back listening. Relax with Gold Rock Radio. It's actually kind of easier with the, with the planet in the backdrop. Easier to see things. But uh. like the space, and you don't see shit. Perfect. Bam. Now oh, that's a bonus for early delivery. That's good. Huh? And living the life. Time to own some guns to the car. Yeah. That's gonna be the uh, the star citizen. One day. Now when that day gonna come, we will never know. Huh? Alright, do the one have to go and there somewhere, I guess. Yeah, there. Prime all essentials. 
That's the upgrade, seems like, judging by the icon. Paints. Armored Link. Terminal. Supplies. Uh, jobs. Uh, right, fine, let's go to do them. The quest. Not trash here. Clean your premises. This guy already like carrying some garbage. You can be like scrapping things. I wonder how that works. I will explain later. Oh, the amount of trash there though. How do we get there? Mm, that might actually be good. I need the terminal. 3.8, 3 3.8, alright. That seems kinda. Oh, yeah, you need the terminal. Let's go. Roster's doing good this way. Probably like if you look at it, I'm just like somewhere in the middle again. Kinda. Now where is this boy? Graphic. That ain't 85. Here and there. There's some at the top, too. It's kind of harder to see because of the space in the bear drop. Stop. Yeah, 
Okay, so you basically just give me the cargo there to deal with it. Oof. Beyond core. Okay. Dude, I'm kind of scared now. I guess I can do it one at a time, though. But that's not too bad. probably was at the top somewhere. Rob is dying all the time. I could just try to like completely exhaust the oxygen though I guess. Grub is important seemingly. I just turn it off here. They kind of don't take damage. That's good. So we have all the oxygen. Maybe we'll try. 9% down. You know what? I'm going to put like 20 there. That will be a little better. Not refill. At that, I'm not sure actually. In the general, how are we doing? That is something I want to figure jumping. There should be a way, but like I, I haven't found yet. Relax. Put it somehow without taking damage. So for now, the only one I found is like buying new ones and selling the, uh, the empty ones for part of the price. I don't think that's the right way. There should be some way to recharge them, but I haven't found yet. Like I went to refuel station, but you literally just refuel. Alright, so we need to keep an eye on the oxygen though. I still have like one spare battery, I think, that is full. There's a lot of things I feel like you either like need to get like some quests that will tell you or you just need to like go for some guys or something later because the manual doesn't really have that. A lot of those things are not in the manual. How's the lightning Jenna?
Ooh, that's a fragile one. Bonka Funkiness. I would double jump and it's gonna be the Medusa that. Uh, Dice next gen, nice. Sounds good. There was a highway there, I think, was there. Because like if, if we hit something, that's gonna be very bad. somewhere here all the way that one okay that's nice that's not too bad all right that's a debris that debris is kind of far at least Really close the brain. Store my trailer actually, 100% it shows. We get a little bomb there. Maybe it wasn't anything important. So it just kind of like was for the, for the delivery status, but not for the actual damage. I wonder. So beautiful. There is the, there is the crow there. Kind of felt like it was. Huh? They turn. That kind of did seem like it was uh, a bit of a bump. Over. Oh shit, that's actually kind of a lot of debris here. 
You just save here and stuff. I'm not waiting for you, man. Better paycheck. Maybe for hitting something and worse paycheck. I go first. Let's not. Break for Lucky Jay. How's it looking there? Stressful. Can't be that bad. This is Sour Candy reaching for a grab bag. Anyone out there to chat? Aha, uh -huh, there she is. <laughs> Shoot. Pretend I didn't say anything. No, I haven't seen you actually, I haven't. Got you towing a trailer full of teapots or tiny glass unicorns. That counts as showing on the ropes. Well, I was just bored waiting for a delivery. The shipment of fireworks from Sosa Hall is late. Fireworks? You're such a weirdo. At least I have fun. We're having plenty of fun, thank you very much. Sure, sure. Well, All right, how do we get there? Hundreds of tiny unicorns live in your hands. Anyway, I'll leave you two to it. Sour candy, over and out. Hang on, Ace. I gotta catch up with her. I'll catch up with you in Edgeburg, all right? Sure. Where we entered there? That's a lake. Diddle Road, eh? Okay, from there I assume. Yeah. Okay. See a bunch of garbage around here. Will we be able to turn here? Okay, I don't like that. That little shit there. Careful, LJ. Don't damage the cargo. Oh, we're good, huh? We're good, huh? I'm close. I knew I knew that one was there. Didn't still kinda hit a bit or something? I think it should be fine. The maneuver was kind of a big guy. Turn. It's like bomb fuck uh, nowhere. Type of highway. With a bunch of rocks in front of it there. can need to do to approach it from from down there oh come on what is this can we sneak in Has this ever happened to you? If you're a little bit from the side This is Gold Rock Radio. No wonk. 
going. So they got another one. I mean, yeah, I haven't seen that. I haven't seen that actually. Hey, Ace. Looks like you made it to Edgeburg. Not one of my favorite sectors, but it's the journey and not the destination, right? That seems like they're hopefully gonna be less trash though around there. Oh, they closed down? No, they went independent again, but like, yeah, that is... They sure aren't in a good spot, let's put it that way. Okay, where the fuck is Drop Zone here? I guess we'll follow the lines. There is no debris around here. I don't mind. Those you want. Sony refunding Concord purchases. I mean, it's not really surprising if, like, the game is dead, then there is, like, you know, you can't really play that. Because they didn't add any single player to that shit for 40 bucks, so... This a big yikes, man. Were they taking it offline on Friday? Holy... Oof. Now that's a massive fucking hell. The potato hello. You can just turn it in free to play? I, I thought they would. I thought that would be a good idea, yeah. Yeah, without, without 40 bucks. Even though now everyone clowned on the game too, so it's gonna be hard anyway to get the player base in it. But, I mean, yeah, they could try to like, salvage it. Now they're just taking full hell there. I mean, I guess. Oh. Living the life service life, man. I think that, that rock maybe was like so small it didn't really damage me or something. Or I'm not sure if I... It didn't feel like I hit it, but it was really close, that's for sure. It's actually kind of bad, huh? I could major bait you here now. Oh, that's kind of perfect, though. Oh, yeah, that's an interesting way to do it, really. I think I need to back off here, rather. Otherwise, it's going to be interesting to get out of here. Okay, I can do it this way. Get me more space here. Oh shit, oxygen though. Kick. Oxygen battery a little down. Got the oxygen. That's fine. Oxygen generator operation, air filters in good working condition, that hull breaches have been patched. I'm not sure if I can see the hull breaches that easy. Let's reuse this one too while I'm at it. Man, can I put this somehow so it doesn't take damage? Like, it, no matter where you put it, it still drops it a bit. Like, why? It damages. Yeah, they could just like, uh, what was the name, the uh, the one that recently got kind of like, also from life service. Now we're good, bro. Oh, 
Oh, really? There was already there. Like, I should at least like, ditch the cargo there in. Ah, brother. <laughs> That's what you get for this, I guess. All right. Emergency. All right. Did it get all my cargo and stuff, too? Dude. Uh, did, oh, man. Really? The Atlas, the glassware, and then get a go, go for it again? Uh, bro, seriously. So can it just return you even before the mission? Can you to go pick it again and go deliver it again? Oof. Holy shit, you don't want you don't want to get in that situation. Commission need to jump jump in the in the suit real quick then. No oh, come on, was I called oh it was already there. I could just like detach that stuff also while I was going for the the replacement. I thought it would be fine, but Oof. The upgrade shop? Yeah sure, sure. Yes. Wait. No targets over there. Oh, there we go. I'm okay with that. Got the zero. Foster, stronger, uh, working harder. Backlog dampener. Cargo damage resistance. Suit station. Upgrade suit management system. Increase power oxygen recharge rate. That's on suit only. Sensors. Um, 29%. So wait there. I see. I see. I know the feel, man. I know the feel. Reinforced plating, impact resistant thermal insulation, anti-capacitive shielding, passive discharge rate. Turbo pump, acceleration brake power, top speed, thrust and cooler efficiency, fuel efficiency. Let's see, that's the upgrades there. I should check that in the store while I was there. Essentials. Oh man, I like it. Hmm. Isn't it now like well, let me let me see. Did it kinda like no, I don't think it loaded me even. Because like if all my stuff is like discharged now, it probably is, right? Ooh, man, that's so much wasted. Uh, could just like... Uh, that was like three jumps. Atlas Prime. Actually, maybe we are in Atlas Prime at least. No, actually, yeah, yeah, we are. Pick up and drop off. Oof. Wait. There is it even... I can go to Medusa now. And that's interesting. Like, where is the cargo then? Pick up. Oh, wait, it's literally there in Edgeburg already. So, like, I'm picking it up and then dropping it down again, seems like. Right there. Uh, I mean, I guess. Is there some. Oh, you could actually save, man. I should do that more. Actually, that's in Edgeburg, right? Let me see. Because that, that is just like redoing all this, all this trip again. 
gears when I run. Okay, then thank you for the auto save at least. Yeah, should look here more. Oh, you happening? Controls get stuck. Just running to the right there. Ah, still. Dude, can you like sit down or something? Dizzy, not die from the dark of oxygen, brother. Sorry, can wait a little. You still paused anyway. Huge. Nice, Steve. Nice. Gotta check it out. Feels good. Eh? I do want to say a war. Then I'll die to some bullshit or something. I'll not die, but yeah. If you know what I mean. And that was very unfortunate there. Same kind of road there. Should I back into it? I feel that will be better. I mean, that's like not a problem really. Without the cargo, it's not really a problem to turn. You can kind of turn in the spot here with all the thrusters. Not the problem. get the damage there. Whatever, that's fine. That's a good one. An early delivery and stuff too. Three. What did you even manage to get that damage there? But the money though, yeah. Hell yeah. Thanks for the favor. I owe you one. Uh, maybe two, since these fragile jobs can be rough on the nerves. I can make it up to you though. Next time you're in Emerald Junction, I'll give you some tips on sprucing up that rig of yours. That's good, Ready? eh? We could have used that. No, surely could, huh? The fuck was that? Huh? I mean, that was kind of about to, almost. I don't think I hit that. Who would be more careful? All right, what do we have here? Chaos works. Yarda. Oh, 
Studio of Zero Two. Uh, the U board, uh, Emerald Junction. That's where you want to go. Hmm. Maybe we should check. Where's the jewel board though? Foundry. So we need to go Medusa and then the Emerald, but we'll take some jobs on the way too. Where can that be? The jobs. And just IRL now. Can't even find them. I guess I can do Medusa and then. And then, then maybe we'll find something. And some garage there. Yard. Um, maybe yard gives some. Foundry Hole sounds like the the place you probably get some stuff. Some job is that sounds important. Hurry, bro. Not even that close. Come on. Let's see one. Jobs. The way to dink, the way to dink. Come on. All right, speeding too much. Fix that. CG dice sounds good. Eh? So that didn't that didn't have any jobs, looks like. Fine, back to Medusa then, I guess. Man. Stop. No, it's just like... Wipes and stuff going on. Eh? Only something. Or whatever. Mm -hmm. 
This goes to the yards and garages and stuff. I mean, I think we're kind of more or less fine. Are you going? Or is someone entering? The physics, man, the physics. I'm going like a car. Man, I got the kick. Gotta eat some. Gotta eat some. The checkpointing. Yes, 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 sure, sure, bro. This is an automated inspection checkpoint. Please be patient while we check for compliance with local regulations. Don't even have anything. Check complete. Results are satisfactory. Have a great day. I love you guys. Oh shit, there you are. Oh, welcome back to the dungeon. Thank you, Sora. Thank you, thank you. I appreciate it a lot. Thank you. How are we doing? I'm yoloing, but I'm gonna be a scary yolo because you can see shit here. I feel like some of the durability things, I'm gonna get the first thing first, probably. Just to take less damage from all this debris. Alright, the gates are kinda of over there, let's go. That's the debris. More debris. Get the job on the way. Is it too far? Nah, I think fine. Let's go finish the quest. Nice to be a dice. Doing good, doing good. Doing pretty good. But I have to right in front of the gate. Doing pretty good, eh? Now we trucking in space. Gonna get some kick. Already got the kick. I just need to get some tea and consume the kick. Press gate to pay money for all right. Well, 50 is not too bad at least. I'll take it. The oxygen dying again. Welcome to Emerald Junction. This is an automated inspection checkpoint. Please be patient while we check for compliance with local regulations. <laughs> inspection has concluded. Result is green. Please enjoy the rest of your journey. Best spot to stay, probably, but 
Hopefully all good. Eh? Already more batteries dying too. Huh? Get rid of the exit from the gate. Just don't use it. Wait for me. Don't authorize any jumps. Bumps. How's it going? You got time to chat? I've been thinking about all the long haul contracts I've taken recently. Those are my favorite kinds of gigs, you know, but they rack up the miles pretty damn fast. Between the distance and micro damage, I end up needing new coats of paint even faster than sour candy does. Of course, she doesn't care that much about the style. See somewhere. Actually, no idea. Should say somewhere under the speedometer. Oh, it is actually, yeah. That's what I figured. You still got a pretty good warranty on that old girl. Must be nice to still get free repairs. But as handy as that is, the dealership. Yeah, that's why it was the repair. First, I say. Let's see. It's kind of a cool way to do it. All right. Great. Once you hit 80,000 miles, head to my buddy's paint shop in Atlas Prime. He'll set you up with a slick new look. That's a cool way they did it. Right. I gotta run. So I'll leave you to it. Catch you again soon, LJ. Red Eddie, out. A the warranty. Shouldn't even get here then. Gonna be abused the warranty to the max. Now we're almost done with it. There's some repair shop here actually. I could use some. Doesn't seem like one. Come on. Where did they get that one? Actually, now in upgrade shop, I think I got right the body repair now or not. I think it was though. Maybe we do have some repairs to do. <laughs> nice save, nice. The lifetime one. Insane. Alright, let's save it though. Let's save it though. Very nice, very nice.